today I will show you how to use the find that lead tool in finding email addresses. So first you need to make sure that you have the find that lead extension installed in your browser right here and you can get this from the Chrome store. So there are several ways that you can do in searching for emails. Um, first, you can go to the website of the company that you want to contact, launch the extension, and here is the email. From here, you can check whether this is a valid email or not by just clicking on this check button. And this one says it is a valid email. Another option is if you have the first and last name of the person that you want to contact, you can just type it in here and find that lead will find the email for you. Okay, so using the lead search, you must have the full name and the domain to perform a search. Say so we're looking for Tom person knows email in TCK okay so this is the email address for Tom Corson knows and it also shows a 99% confidence score which means that this email most likely will not bounce back in your inbox Next is the domain search where you can find all um, several email addresses on a specific domain. So let's try TCK Publishing. And it's now showing a list of what find it lead found in that domain. Next is the email verifier. Okay, so I use email verifier whenever I got an email from a different uh, website so there are times that a website will not be showing their email so let's say this one we didn't find the email address so what we can do is check their social media sites let's go see the Facebook page this is a Facebook page and let's check the about section and then we have an email here okay let's check if this is the correct email by using the email verifier okay so it says this is the correct email this tool is really useful next is the social url search so this feature you can Paste here their Twitter URL or the LinkedIn profile to look for their email. So I'm gonna try a Twitter URL here or let's try this one. Start searching, then get email, and here is the email address for Vilma Iris. Okay, so next, another method is the find that lead add-on. This one, we use this in the spreadsheet. So, if you don't have the find that lead add-on yet, you can get it from this one, get add-ons, and then search for find that lead. Okay, so I actually created a sample spreadsheet here to show you how this works. By the way, um, this method works best if you have the data for the first name, the last name, and the domain. So it, it, will, uh, it depends what project you're working on. Okay, so let's start open FTL
Okay, so there are three ways here that we can do. Let's try the email finder first. Okay, so make sure that the columns corresponds to the correct letter. So A, B, and C. Check this one if your spreadsheet has headers. We have headers here. And then search for emails. Okay. See what um, what Find It Lead did is it created another column for email address, the status, and uh, the the confidence score. And then on this column, as you can see, the last two rows, the status is a guess. So what Find It Lead? find that we did is it it provided a suggestion like this is the suggested email format that we can consider since this status is a guess so this is another great feature of find at lead next is prospector okay so this is similar to the domain search you insert the domain name here and the final lead will show you a list of the emails that you can find so let's try let's try this one agnesspot.edu find emails okay so what it did is it, it, it created another spreadsheet for that um, search domain search so there is a hundred emails here from that domain and it also shows the confidence score on the next column okay next is the verifier okay um, so this one what 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 this is actually did is it shows the status or the confidence score for for the emails that you already have so let me just delete this columns right here and let me show you how it works so since we have the column for the email address already let's see let's verify those emails So again, it is showing the status for those emails and the confidence score. We got three correct email addresses right here. Okay, so those are the different ways that you can do in finding emails by using the find it lead.